Hello friends, we have covered oral reflexes in a video before and today I'm going to talk about oral reflex integration therapy so that these exercises can help your child in actions like biting, chewing and swallowing independently. We are going to use a simple chewy tube for this action today for all the activities that will follow. A green chewy tube which is T in shape and has a knobbly stem. The first reflex we are going to talk about is the rooting reflex which is if there is a stimulation done at the angle of the mouth near the lips the child tends to move their head towards that side. So this is an indication of a retained reflex even in older children. So how to integrate this reflex? First turn the head of the child towards one side then stimulate the side that is facing you and start with the angle of the mouth moving over the cheeks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. The same thing you can repeat on the opposite side as well. Turn it the head towards the opposite side and then stimulate. The second exercise for the same is where you have to stimulate from the corner of the nose to the corner of the mouth. So again turn the head towards one side. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Try to do it gently. Initially, your child may not want to do it ten times. It's okay to start with five times and then increase the number of counts. And this exercise can these two exercises can be done twice a day. The indication that the reflex is getting integrated would be the more you stimulate the child will have less of a tendency to turn their head suddenly towards that side or any kind of lip movement that you will observe. The second reflex would be sucking reflex where a sucking action is seen when anything touches near the lips. So we start the stimulation in the opposite direction this time which is in front of the ear to the angle of the mouth. One two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. The same thing can be used on the opposite side as well. Because we are stimulating the cheeks in this case, so we are going to prompt cheek action. So the, the second part of that would be blowing the cheeks out. So first you can show how to blow the cheeks out and ask the child to pop them while you release the air so that they understand what action is happening. So, hmm, 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 hmm. Depending on how the child pops your cheek, you can blow out the air accordingly and then you can try to repeat the same action with the child. Try to do this with hold so that the cheek muscles are stimulated and they are also strengthened. Another action in the opposite direction also helps. Because there is a continuous movement of cheeks going in and out while the sucking action happens, so also ask the child to pull the cheeks in with a hold. All of these activities can be done 5 to 10 times and twice a day. And finally, we are going to talk about the gag reflex. If the gag reflex is really active in the child, you need to know that initially it is in the front part of the tongue and as solids, more solids are introduced to the child, it keeps moving back. So we are going to work on the front and using 
the chewy tube this way transversely so that you don't accidentally stimulate it or you touch the soft palate or the back part of the hard palate and again stimulate or induce the reflex. So we are going to start in the front. Take it a little back. Then move from back to front first. And finally front to back. Because of the flat and uniform surface, the child will be less likely to gag. Ask them to take out their tongue as much as possible so that it is easier. So ask them to take their tongue out and then start the stimulation rather than doing it inside the mouth which is more likely to induce the reflex rather than helping to integrate. I hope these reflex integration activities were helpful for you. If they were, please mention it in the comments below along with any queries or suggestions that you might have. Also like the video, subscribe to the channel for more videos related to child development and reflex integration therapy. Ring the bell icon for notifications when my videos are out and we'll meet again soon. Bye.